<coughs> Hi, good evening to all. Today's topic is all about the blood choice na payment. It is an important topic of the business law. We will look at the meaning of the blood first and moving forward the rest of the related to the blood. Section 172 of the Indian Contract Act 1956 defines Blood as the payment of goods as a security for a payment of a debt or for a performance of a promise. According to the section 172 of the Indian Contract Act, defines the pledge term as the payment of goods used as a security for the repay the debt or the <coughs> performance of a given promise. Its purpose is the goods are delivered as a security for loan or the performance of the promise. It acts as a security in case in case of loan or to perform our promise. Our rights are the a pledge has, has the right to sell the pledged goods and default after giving a notice to the pledger. <coughs> Bledgina who holds the pledged goods, he has the right na, to sell the pledged goods and default na, of the pledger after giving a proper notice to the pledger. Use of goods, na, a bledgina has no right na, to use the goods na, pledged. Bledgina has no right to use the goods na, by the pledger. Return of goods na a pledge is not bound to return the goods na delivered unless the debt is pay, repaid or promises na performed. The pledger na the pledger na has to na repay the debt na or na perform the promise or else na the pledge na has not returned the goods. Pledge na won't return the goods. A lien can be exercised na, for the non-payment of interest. Whereas the payment na, section 148 in the states na, payment is the delivery of goods by one person to another for some purpose upon a contract na, that they shall when the purpose is accomplished na, be returned or otherwise na, disposed of according to the directions of the person delivered them. <coughs> According to the section 148 of the Indian Contract Act 1956 na, says na, defines the payment na, is a deliver of goods na, from one person to another for a specific purpose and that time the contract will be made na, between them when once the purpose is accomplished na, be written the goods na, to the real owner or the disposed of according to the directions of the persons na, delivered, delivered them. Purpose the goods are delivered for any purpose except as a security. It's not act as a security. A payee na, <coughs> a payee na, to whom na, the goods are na, delivered has no right to sell. He can retain the goods or the shoe for the dues. He na, he won't na, he has not right na, to sell the goods but na, he can retain the goods na, as long as na, he get the debt or the shoe for the dues. There is no such restrictions if the nature of a transaction so requires. They don't have any specific na, rights. In graduates na, payment na, the payee is na, bound to return the goods and na, na, demand by the Payler. <coughs> in unnecessary payment, the, the payee is bound to return the goods on demand to the payer by the payer. Lien can be exercised the, for the labor the spent. <coughs> the next the difference between promissory note and bill of exchange. Promissory note the section 4 the, as per the Negotiable Instrument Act 1981, 1881, it means na, is na, 
is an instrument in writing not being a banknote or a currency note containing an unconditional undertaking signed by the maker to pay a certain sum of money only to order the order of a certain person or to the period of the instrument. Promissory note is a transaction instrument. It is in writing containing an unconditional undertaking by signed by the maker who prepares the promissory note to pay a certain sum of money only to the, or to the order of a certain person who may be in a promise or to the bearer of the instrument, the holder of the instrument. But the bank note or currency note is not a promissory note. There are two parties, maker or promiser and the payee or promisee. These names are not denoted by in the function of a promissory note. It contains an unconditional undertaking to pay. The liability of the maker is the primary and absolute. <coughs> maker na kuna prepares the promissory note. He is the absolute and the primary one. Acceptance is not necessary as it is, as it is payable by the person who makes it. There is no necessary to accept the promissory note. The maker stands an immediate relation with the payee. Notice of a dishonor is not necessary to the maker. Maker and the payee cannot be the, the one and the same person. No protest is required. Whereas na bill of exchange na, <clears throat> its meaning is a given under the section na five of the na negotiable instrument act 1881 is an instrument in writing contain a, containing an unconditional order signed by the maker directing a certain person to pay a certain sum of money only to or to the order of a certain person or to the period of the instrument bill of exchange na. <clears throat> It's also the and transaction instrument the, it is in writing format and it holds the unconditional order the, signed by the maker he is sometimes called as the drawer directing a certain person to pay a certain sum of money only to or to the order of a the certain person or to the bearer of the instrument. There are three parties, drawer, drawee and the payee. Drawer na, who makes the bill of exchange, drawee who accepts the pay, bill of exchange, payee na, who makes the payment. It contains an unconditional order to pay. The liability of the drawer is na, secondary and the conditional. He becomes liable only when the drawee refuses to be to honor the bill. <clears throat> if a drawee refuses na, to honor the bill, that time na, the drawer is a liable one. It should be presented na, to the drawee for acceptance. It may be accepted na, conditionally. The acceptance is necessary in, in, in case of a bill of exchange. The drawer na, stands in immediate relation to the drawee or acceptor and not to the payee. The relationship in the between the drawer and the try only, not the to the pay. Notice of a dishonor should be given to all the parties. All the parties means drawer, try and the pay. Liable and the bill. Drawer and the pay cannot be the one and the same person. But in case of a promissory note, then there is the <coughs> there the there is not one person. Troyer and the payee are the should be different. Troyer and the payee should be different one. A foreign bill is required in the to be protested in the for a dishonor. Foreign bill in the is required in the to be protested in the for a dishonor the bill. Thank you. We will see you again with another session. Until then, stay tuned. Stay blessed. Bye.